It is an explosion of culture, colors, and high spirits this weekend. Tomorrow kicks off Hispanic Heritage Month with Mexican Independence Day this Monday. But as our Durante Matthews shows us, they're not waiting to get started here in Milwaukee. The twists and twirls aren't just dances. And this shows, shows the joyful part. But expressions of cultural pride. The part where people come together and celebrate a, a heritage. Hispanic heritage. Milwaukee is gearing up for the month-long celebration, which starts Sunday. Father Ricardo Martin says the celebration also falls in line with St. Adelbert's Parish Festival. I think it helps to bring the, the, the foods, the meals, the music, the culture that they have in all these countries. For one blended experience. From the food to the flags to the families, organizers say Hispanic Heritage Month events are an all-in-one way to showcase the rich cultures and communities growing in Milwaukee every day. It's, it's like our 4th of July. So there's, there's a lot of importance to this day. Mexican Independence Day festivities also kicked off early Saturday at Zocalo Food Park on 6th Street. The celebration marks Mexico declaring its independence from Spain on September 16, 1810, and also recognizes Milwaukee's growing Hispanic population. We're here to commemorate um, our, our ancestors that have come here and uh, have made Milwaukee home. While these parties were in effect, parade preps were also in motion. Our theme for the parade as our 50th anniversary is Viva Mexico, Viva Independence. United Migrant Opportunity Services, or UMOS, spent Saturday lining the banners for Sunday's parade and festival. It's very important for us to just have the opportunity to bring our culture, our community together in a cultural way. In a sense, a melting pot mixed with Latin flavors. In Milwaukee, Durante Matthews, Fox 6 News. Nemo's Mexican Independence Day Parade starts at 10 tomorrow morning. The free event begins at South 20th in Oklahoma. It ends in the Nemo's parking lot at South Chase Avenue for the annual festival.